Right. Okay. All right. Hello. Hey guys. <laughs> Probably wondering what's happening. It's the new moon. We're in Ashley's bed. We're in my bed. <laughs> celebrating. Celebrating the new moon and all of the <laughs> amazing new things that are on the horizon. <laughs> Including me being able to walk again. Um, hopefully that'll happen tomorrow. Yeah. Um, but we're living Poor our thing. new life in San Marcos, Texas, yeah. the most beautiful city in the world. It's very beautiful here, so um, I'm enjoying it. Most beautiful people in the world, and all the fun things are happening. Yeah. So we have a new moon today, mm. so we thought we'd jump on here, continue our new moon, full moon kind of ritual with the videos. Um, we've been reading a book, <laughs> um, slash listening to it, uh, what's the author's name? Julia Cannon, and the book is called Soul Speak, and it's amazing. Highly about recommended. Your body and how your body sends you very specific messages uh, through sensation, and pain, and stuff like that. Yeah, um, yeah. So it's been interesting. If you when you live closer, oh, yeah. sorry. <laughs> if and when you live in your body. Don't move. I don't want you to hurt yourself. You start getting all these pains, and you start feeling them. And then, basically, her message of this book, and there's a lot of stuff like this, a lot of books with this kind of theme, is that your body is constantly giving you a message. And um, I've been doing reading a lot of. I've been doing a lot of tantric living, reading about a lot about tantric living, <laughs> trying I'm to do a lot it. of living. Yeah. But part of that is really, you know, when your heart's open, that you are fully open to not only the pleasure, the good, but you do have to be open to um, the pain. And so, yeah, we're laying here in bed because I have a rib out of place, um, which has happened to me before. Um, and I walked around like that for a year. So I figured, what's a day? We're iced in. <laughs> A Texas blizzard. What's a day? Yeah. We're iced. All the businesses are closed. Everything is closed. I'm going to yeah. go to my chiropractor tomorrow morning. Um, so for now, you're doing what? Laying in bed. Doing what you can with what Adrian you have. Adrian brought a crystal. What's this crystal you brought for so me? So I brought a green apotholite for Ashley. This is my favorite healing crystal for physical pain. Um, energetic pain, physical pain. Well, all the same thing mm. related. Definitely. Uh, anyway, green apotholite mm. is one of my favorite stones to place on my body when I'm having pain. I haven't had what Ashley's having, so who knows, you know, uh, how this will go. But I thought, well, shit, since we're iced in, we may as well, <laughs> may as well try something else. Iced in. But, you know, the green's perfect for the heart chakra, too, mm, um, mm -hmm. which is where your ribs are. And... and so, yeah, that's probably an ideal stone. Green apothalite also works with all energy centers. And, um, yeah, I, I, for the past year, so actually not in the past year, but like the year prior to that, got a little, a lot of really severe cramps. Yes, I was going to say, you started what about using your cramps the green apothalite. <laughs> Um, on my cramps because I just tried different like, you know, med medicines and stuff, mydol and all that mm, stuff. Right. Um, and the green apothalite was actually the thing that worked the best for me. So I put that on me and I'd usually fall asleep and it was like a miracle worker. Everything would just go away. So it has an amazing feeling. I can feel it when I put it, you know, on me, just mm -hmm. kind of the way that it starts moving, um, the energy in my body. So there you go. It's very lovely. Is that an epidote in quartz? Yeah, on so you? on yeah, my, I'm, on I'm my, sorry, everybody. no, that's okay. This is cover you up for see. one second. We're still here. <laughs> no, having, don't go anywhere. We're still, tuned. we're still here. She's getting her her epidote in quartz. Yeah, so this guy, triangle twin, epidote in quartz, is an epidote in quartz. Um, so the green stones, which you could see more in Ashley's piece, uh, it's called epidote, and then the clear crystal surrounding that is quartz and this is also an amazing physical healer so I often put this on different parts of my body mm. um to work with physical pain um I took a bath with this guy uh yeah earlier which was nice but yeah so today's a great day to set new moon intentions mm. which is a lot about um yeah what do you want to set for the next <laughs> month ahead mm -hmm. 
Yeah, and this is a really powerful first new moon of the year of 2018. So it's really all about, you know, coming into your ownership of your life, your personal power, hmm. leadership, all these great things. Um, so I'm excited to see uh, what it brings and to set some specific intentions, I think, for me around that and my business. So get ready. <laughs> Get ready. Get ready, world. Get ready. Here we come. Well, actually, that's funny because people often say, like, oh, are you guys selling something? Oh, yeah. Like, oh, well, we're just really yeah, our, selling our, our, our um, love to the world, giving it to you for free here on YouTube. But <laughs> we do sell stuff involving crystals and other stuff. Um, I have a little Etsy store, uh, which doesn't haven't sold anything on there, really. Just a couple, <laughs> couple, couple of items. I've really sold, sold more in person or in other ways, but even again, not very much. <laughs> but here, Oil Sage, she's legit. Legit. I've I've have some sales. Mm -hmm. Yeah, oilsage.etsy.com. Reviews and sales and oh, good reviews. I just so. give all my stuff away for free. That's what I am. I just walk around <laughs> giving it all for free. <laughs> yeah, maybe. This so is see me on the street. You never know what you get. Oh <laughs> uh, well. Uh, anything else? What else should we? That's about it. Yeah, we're just hoping for, you know, to be thawed out in the morning so I can drive to the chiropractor. Mm, yeah, that'll be um, nice. Yeah, we're just settling in. Oh, I see a snow flurry. A oh, snow shit. flurry just happened. Yeah, well, I'm just going to lay in bed while it snows. Yeah. And just, you know. Thank you all for watching, and we love you. And, you know, say a prayer for me. Send a yeah. wish lantern out into the night. <laughs> Send um, some healing energy her way because she needs it. She's... Healing energy and love. No, it's all going to be good. It's all good. It is. Um, but we're going to say this might not be our last video from bed. <laughs> Let us know what you think. Should we do more videos from bed? You know what else I put in? I have to say there's one crystal in this bed that we can't see. You're not talking about this one. Are you? <laughs> <laughs> no. Okay, because okay. my heart is, you know, the heart stuff is happening mm -hmm. with the ribs. I have the jade egg. Oh. So I oh. Pop, pop that boy boy in. That's smart. Yoni egg, folks. And we're going to make a whole episode about yoni yes. eggs. Yes, yeah. Oh, maybe from bed. Oh, definitely from bed. Maybe. If you, if you want to see a yoni video from bed, yeah, tell us what you think. Yeah, you know, if you have any questions, you want answered about it or anything. Yes, let us know. We'd love to hear from you. So. Yes. Um, okay, we love you guys. Bye. Bye.